Welcome everybody back to the channel. In this video, we hop inside game with the M4 and we see if it's still good to use instead of MWZ. Drop a like, subscribe to the channel and enjoy. Yeah, mods for sponsoring this video. They are a awesome Call of Duty service company. Basically, they go in, they unlock stuff for you. They give you the Borealis and Interstellar camo. You can play in lobbies to complete hard challenges that maybe you just can't complete. They're trusted by thousands of customers. They have very, very, very good reviews with Trustpilot. Make sure you guys go check them out. Link is in the description. You guys can use code SPAZO to save up to $100 off on your order. All right, today we're doing the M4. Now, I've used this weapon a little bit in MWZ, and I used to use it for the Tier 3 schematic runs, but I really wanted to hop in game and see if, is it, if it still is good, and could it be another good gun to use inside of MWZ? So we're going to check it out. We're going to triple pack it, get it legendary, buy all of our perks, everything. So whenever you have the, uh, what's this blueprint called again? The Soul Harvester. It came out in MW2. It was a... Uh, blueprint you got if you pre-ordered mw3 well whenever you use this you start with the dead wire ammo mod which already just makes this already freaking good man so we're gonna be uh testing it out and i'll see you guys whenever we can get this thing triple packed and legendary okay, we're headed to the wonder fizz right now we are about to get all of our perks triple pack it and do all that good stuff this is exciting man there's a bunch of people talking in chat they are talking about doing something. <laughs> all right, let's get our perks real quick. Just grab all of them up. All right, we'll throw in a legendary ether tool. Okay, now Pack-a-Punch is just right over here. Uh, I kind of want to keep the base blueprint, so we're going to melee the Pack-a-Punch. Yeah, yeah, we'll definitely do that. I like the Pack-a-Punch camo, but sometimes I just don't like it. Simply. It is just that simple. Okay, let's melee it real quick. Try not to die. All right, one, two, three. There we go. Now, if we do go to the Dark Aether, it, we will lose it. So we do need to keep that in mind. Uh, ooh, there's a bounty contract right here. We can just go ahead and grab this one. The new spawns, I'm not used to the new spawns yet, uh, to be honest. <laughs> Sometimes I'll just, I'll go straight to the other locations that they had, and then I'll realize that they changed them. There's a buy station right there. We 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 have all of our characters max, so we don't really need to buy nothing. Uh, 200 meters away. Okay, what is it? A mega abomination? Ooh, he's right here. It's been a minute since I got this spawn. But I guess we can test out the M4 again. See if it's any good. All right, there we go. Ether Blade is the best schematic, dude. You, I can't even tell you how many runs I've done. With only an ether blade. Like I've gone through tier 3. Have gone through the dark ether. Have gone through elder with just a dark ether blade. It is definitely possible. If you guys would like to see a video on me doing that. I can definitely work on that. Uh, are you going to laser me? Oh. Oh damn. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo what the hell just happened to my boy up there man. Oh my gosh dude. That's crazy, Mega. I'm not even prepared to fight you now. Jeez, dude. I was not prepared for him to drop, first of all. That was crazy. Can I get up here? Can you? No, you can't. <gasps> you can. Shoot his eyes. Get him. There we go. Just keep moving. Try not to get hit by meat. Shoot! There we go. Some zombies down here. Just eat their blade whenever we can. Seems like we got a lot of ammo. 120 rounds in the mag because we're running 60 round magazine. It's not bad. Alright. This should be the last one. And dead. There we go. Okay. Yeah, that wasn't bad at all. Uh, what else did he drop? Another three plate. Well, if somebody randomly comes over here, then I guess they'll see a, a three plate vest they can use. We'll go, go grab this other bounty. That was crazy. He hit that car and just <laughs> darted in the air. Oh my gosh. What would be cool to see is if, like, if they ever add, like, the thunder gun, if it will, uh, it don't, I don't know, man. It'd be hard to, like, 
say if it do a ton of damage to like the mega abomination and stuff i don't know that's just crazy to me to think about but you never know man they could change it to do something are these guys gonna grab this bunny grab what? VR. okay i have yeah. vr 11 so all right, we'll do an outlast. I hate taking people's contracts, man. If they want to do the contract, I always try and let them. You got a scope on? Oh my gosh, dude. They're, dude, everybody's mic is so loud. It just blows your eardrums. Okay. We can do an outlast. There's nothing wrong with that. I love doing the outlast contracts. Okay, maybe we can get a bounty to spawn in after we complete this. But yeah, let me know if you guys want to see an ether blade only dark ether run. Because we definitely could do something like that. Uh, but let's do this PND real quick. Alright. Outlasts are the best contracts. I feel like I say that a lot. But I really try and get my point across on that. The Outlasts are the best. Uh, if I had to choose between a cargo contract and a uh, Outlast contract. It's Outlast all day. Uh, okay. That is why like in my videos. I don't really pick up cargos. Only if there's zero contracts. I'll pick up a cargo. But most of the time I don't. Okay. You know what? I'm going to be honest. Deadwire is my most hated <laughs> ammo mod. Because when it works, you the zombie just stands there. And like, say you do the dead shot spam aim, you're just going to keep locking onto him. Unless you move. So it gets annoying. There's a mangler down there. Oh my gosh. Okay. Take some of these zombies down easy super easy okay kill this mangler get rid of him uh do we have any more zombies we'll just throw that we're at 80 percent all last contracts are always quick too you know what contract i haven't done in quite a minute is the weapon saves i don't ever do those i don't ever see a, a pro of really doing those too much anymore all right, we'll throw this ether blade, and we're done. All right, we're probably going to take down some extra zombies. We could throw this just in case. Nothing. All right. Another three plate. Dang. We have two three plates. Uh, we can drop that. We have no need for that. Is there a bounty contract anywhere? Uh, there's one way over here. Okay, we can go try and grab that. All right, let's grab this bounty. Okay, what is it going to be? That is the big question here. Another mega. Okay. Okay. I already kind of seen this gun against the mega. He's over here. Okay, that don't normally happen. It's usually on the completely opposite side that you found the contract on. Oh my gosh. We better move. All right, yeah, 120 meters away. You guys know my strat when it comes to doing this side. So we have nothing to worry about here. Uh, yeah, we should be good. Okay. We just need to get him into this building over here. Uh, there he is. Let's shoot him a little bit. Get him locked on us. You know what? I'm going to try this gun in single fire. There we go. Okay, let's play it up real quick. Dang. <laughs> it actually does a lot of damage. I think damage boosts off of uh, switching to single fire. I'm pretty sure. Ugh. Get me up here. And then we can drop down to our typical spot. We can start blasting. So anyways, I started blasting. I need him to laser me. Ugh, stick it through. I'm going to run across here. Spray. It's such a beam. Let's reload real quick. So it's usually two mags on the last eye. And then we reload. And then eyeball. Mouth. And done. There we go. Yeah, that's actually not bad at all. What is that? Ooh, no. Ooh, Reagan case. I'll actually take that, dude. Uh, here's a zombie. Okay, that was just terrible. <laughs> that was terrible loot. I ain't even gonna lie. Let's go take down this other one down here. 
Why not? Looks like he's attacking somebody. I'm coming to help you, brother. Don't worry. Don't let him beat your dog up. Let me throw this monkey. Oh, gosh. I'm right here. Open them eyes. Ugh. Oh, no. Ugh. Jeez. <laughs> All right. Come on, boys. Let's get him. Yes, this is the moment, boys. Oh, no. Oh, shit. 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 Oh, gosh. Dude, they're all chasing me. <gasps> oh, God, dude. <laughs> oh, my God. Let me go. Let me go, man. I was just playing, dude. I was just bullshitting. Oh, my God. Can he laser? Take the mango. Oh, yes. We gotta reload real quick. Get his eye. Oh, my gosh. Just spray him. Spray him down. It's crazy when, like, you're not doing critical hits. <gasps> Dang. Well, you guys can have that. You guys want some... Oh, no. No. Okay, well, they just dipped. <laughs> we're going to call it there, fellas. This is a friendly... Oh, Floopsie. That's a cool name. All right, we're going to end it there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I definitely think the M4 is still viable, and you definitely should still be using it instead of MWZ. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy. Do not forget to leave a like. Subscribe to the channel. You guys know the deal. We're waiting on Season 2. There is nothing to do in this game at all. Uh, but let me know if you guys want to see a Etherblade-only Dark Ether run. And I'll see you guys in the next one, boys. I'm out. Have a good one. Peace.